And with breaking news, Cleveland City Councilman Zach Reed has been found guilty of driving under the influence. A jury returning that verdict this afternoon. John Kosick is live on five at the Justice Center with the latest on the story. Yeah, Leon and Lee, Reed showing no emotion in court as that guilty verdict was read. He left court immediately after that verdict and he had nothing to say. The jury deliberated for just under a full day before deciding that Reed was guilty of driving under the influence. The morning of March 5th, when he was pulled over by Cleveland police, Reed refused a breathalyzer and failed a field sobriety test. This was Reed's third DUI. Reed faces a minimum of 10 days and a maximum of six months in jail. His attorney spoke after. Obviously, we're disappointed with the verdict. I can tell you on behalf of Mr. Saffold and ourselves, we have a tremendous amount of respect for the jury system. Um, uh, but again, we're disappointed with the verdict. You can see the strain on some of the jurors' faces as we were looking at them. We had a couple that were actually in tears. Obviously, it was a difficult decision for them. Now, sentencing is set for September 5th. If Reed is, is sentenced for more than 10 weeks, it is likely under the city charter he would lose his council seat. Now, Council President Martin Sweeney said in a statement this afternoon the Councilman Reed is dealing with his own reality. He has asked Reed in the past to resign his position, he said, and his position has not changed. Reporting live in Cleveland, John Council News Channel 5.